Hey guys, I'm Trent. I'm Michael. In this video, we're gonna show you how to make a boss bar with SK Rayfall in script on your Minehunt server. I'm, I'm sorry, Trent's not available right now. Oh, sorry, can you hang up your phone? We're recording. Thanks. So one thing that most servers do, including Minehut, is when you join, you have a little boss bar at the top that says like, welcome, mm -hmm. check out our servers, you Rotating know, like messages. go buy this stuff for us because we want your money, things like that. Money's so, great. Yes, exactly. Exam. So yes. And w one really cool thing that we do on Minehut actually is it like counts down and then it rotates the message when it's done. So we're gonna show you guys how to get started with that on your own server. Cool. cool. So we already have script installed over here, mm -hmm. but this requires a script add-on called SK Rayfall. Mm. So this one's really cool. We're gonna install this plugin over here. And then we're just gonna do the classic server restart and then we'll wait. So our server's finally back online. We are in game here. We can see our smiley face from the last tutorial, but now we're gonna head on over to our text editor and start writing this script. So we wanna send the script or the, the boss bar to the player as soon as they join the server. So also, gonna... just to pause, remember this is an advanced script tutorial. So if you're not familiar with script, you're gonna wanna head back over to our script playlist and get caught up. Yes. So when the player joins the server, we're gonna create boss bar mm -hmm. titled welcome and then we're just going to welcome the player and to do that we're just going to type in player welcome player um but we want to do something nice so we're just going to do like an l and b and then we're just going to do a nice little um something like that i don't know we'll okay. see how those colors look great yep and then Measured. we're gonna do yes and id so we need to set a boss bar id that way later on we can actually go in and update that boss bar cool uh and then the boss bar id will be welcome dot and then player whoops percentage um so we're just going to set a boss bar with the player's uuid here okay players uuid percentage there we go for player so the player that actually joined here it's a with, long line yeah with progress 100 so it's it, the progress is all the way there with colors green there we go so this is a very long line here but what this is going to do here is it's going to create that boss bar like with the player's name and then we're going to save this boss bar here that way later on we can go ahead and update it cool so that's it there and then we're just going to wait five ticks so all that means is there are 20 ticks in a second we're going to wait five of them and then we're going to loop 100 times. So because Whoa. the progress is 100, we're gonna loop through it 100 times so that way we can count down. Mm -hmm. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna do set, and then we're just gonna create a new variable called value. 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 Tab. Yep, yep. Whoops, to value of, and then we're just gonna do boss bar. And then we're gonna just grab that player's, uh, the boss bar that we created up there. So welcome dot percentage players UUID. Mm -hmm. So we're grabbing that player's, uh, the, the setting the value of that. Yep. And then we are just gonna time out for a second and make sure that I've got the line separators correct. So yeah, set value to value boss bar, welcome ID, okay, yep. So we're gonna set the value to what it is currently at and then we're just gonna remove one from value. So we're just gonna remove one from that and then we're just gonna set the boss bar again to make sure that way it like goes down with the progress a little bit. Mm -hmm. So set boss bar, and then we're just gonna reference that one again. Welcome dot players UUID percentage. Uh, let me make sure. Value to value. Okay. Um, let me, yeah. Okay. Value to uh, and underscore value. So hopefully Aaron can make that look like I wasn't pausing and thinking too much. Um, okay, so we're just gonna like set the value of the, the progress on the boss bar down one each time. And then we're going to wait three ticks. And then we are going to then loop that again. So it'll just like loop through that a hundred times, waiting three twentieths of a second. What, how long, how many milliseconds? I don't know either. Um, okay. You know I don't do math. <laughs> and then we're just gonna remove boss bar. <laughs> So that way we're just gonna remove it later. Welcome dot mm -hmm. players UID players. So we're just gonna remove boss bar and cool. then that's it. Okay, so we did a lot of stuff here. We're gonna go in and test it out. So what I should see happen is when I join my server, I should get sent a boss bar that says welcome with my name in it in green. And then I should be able to go in and watch it like count down a little bit. 
So you're pasting it here. You're saving it in the panel now. Remember, we write every script offline so that in yep. case something catastrophic happens to the internet, you have your script saved and you don't lose it. Exactly. And then I went in game, I reloaded my tutorial, and then now I'm just going to reconnect so that way I can throw the join event. Mm -hmm. And there, 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 there was my world's best tutorial server. It, it, really, it truly is. There it is. Whoa. Welcome, Trent. And then, whoa, it's counting down. Wow. Is wow. your name in red? My name's in red. That's kind of ugly, isn't it? I don't know. I don't see red. I'm colorblind. Oh, okay. So welcome, Trent. And then we should see it go away as soon as it counts all the way down. Wow. You did it. That was so cool. The boss bar. And so you could add more messages. So as soon as that one goes away, it sends them a new one. You can do it where it sends different, like you can advertise your server in there, your Discord, whatever you want. And this will just send a nice non-intrusive message to players when they join your yeah, server. Yeah, and it can rotate. It can loop infinitely. There's all sorts of options. Yeah, you could even do it where if I wanted to start drawing, I could set a timer for myself that I can only draw until that little timer up there is done. Crazy. This guy Minecrafts. Crazy. This guy Minecrafts. And that's how you create boss bars on your Minecraft server.